VH1 TV, your best experience. And also, this program is coming to you live from the Silicon House Productions. They are experts in PA sound systems, LED, TV and studio production, broadcasting, events coordination, lights, and their specialty is customer satisfaction. Ladies and gentlemen, to open the show, a round of applause for Ejo Jinam Fafali.
no tissue there was no tissue to use at school have you had to reuse a dirty cloth handkerchief filled with dirt sweat or even mucus this is so unhygienic flora disposable handkerchief is a more hygienic option with 10 absorbent tissue handkerchiefs in a pack you can throw one away after use and still have enough for the day flora disposable handkerchiefs toilet rolls multi-purpose towels table napkins and box tissues now comes in beautiful new packaging as flora joy flora smile and flora giant and are available in a shop near you flora disposable handkerchiefs are better than cloth handkerchiefs isn't that right darling yes mom for both purchases or delta paper mail on 0243 033033 Wait a minute, yo! <laughs> it's on my nephew! Whoa! This place has changed, yo! Angela, no welcome! Yo! Angela, look at you all grown up, yo! Some things never change, like Gino's quality recipe that gives my food that rich color, unique natural taste every time. Smells good, yo! Yeah, sister, we did what Pupun San no Kasa. Just like I remember. Uncle Bo, Uncle Bo, hurry up and let's open the suitcase. Ajua, try. Let me shrink one part. Best jollof I've ever eaten. Wow, this is real jollof, mommy. Gino dear, am I drowning at the Ankasa? Say, Gino dear, fear ni fear. It's delicious, yo! This advert is FDA approved. Woke up this morning. Nothing wakes me up better than a cup of cowbell coffee. Delicious coffee aroma. Mmm. How can you forget your lines again? I'm sorry, sir. Just that it tastes really good. Cowbell coffee. Enjoy the delicious creamy coffee taste of three in one cowbell coffee. Is it this advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. Frez gives you a moment of pure freshness every day. A creamy, rich leather soap with great fragrances. Frez, a unique smooth feeling. Press your moment of escape. Dream your dreams come true. Nivea Dry Impact and Dry Comfort Deodorants. Now with quick dry effect and longer lasting fragrance. Guaranteed to keep you feeling dry and fresh all day long. No matter the heat. Even 48 hours protection and longer lasting fragrance. 
with the dry range of deodorants from Nivea. In a world where you can be anything, who will you become? When you can go anywhere and never be alone, how far will you go? When your voice can reach every ear in the world, who will you inspire? When your money can travel faster and further, who will it reach? When you can tell a story in every language, which one will you tell? When you don't need permission to turn your dreams into reality, you go for it. Whatever it is, wherever it is, go. And when you think you've reached your limit, we'll keep you going. Let's go. right did you enjoy it yeah it was a good one i enjoyed it i danced all through and nanaba tried to do some abaja we didn't uh, yeah she doesn't even know how to do it i know how to do it yes, yes. she's yes. <laughs> yeah welcome back once again the next tv star is live on gh1 tv we are live on facebook and also you can watch us Feely Feely in UHD 4K quality via the HD Plus Channel 100. The next TV star is brought to you by Flora Tissues, MTN, Gino, Cowbell, Chop Shop, Infonifie. My dress is by Sema Brew. My hair, oh my hair, and my makeup, Cookie the Makeup Girl. The show it brought, is broadcasting live from the Silicon House Productions and they are experts in PA sound systems. LED, TV and studio production, broadcasting and events coordination, lights, and their specialty is customer satisfaction. You can visit them on www.siliconhousegh.com. You can call them on 050-958-2759. You can walk into any of the Chop Shop branches for amazing food experiences, you can find Chop Shop in Osu, in Dansuman, in Airport Residential, Northridge, and East Legon. You can call them on 030-277-9009. Chop Shop, Ghana's good food brand. Now, has your child ever told you that there was no tissue to use at school? Have you ever had to clean your face or hands with a dirty cloth handkerchief filled with debt or even sweat? Well, that is so unhygienic. And imagine tossing it into your pocket or bag where the germs can easily spread to other items. Well, the flower disposable handkerchief is a more hygienic option with 10 absorbent tissue handkerchiefs in a pack. You can throw one away after use and still have enough for the day. The flower disposable handkerchiefs, the toilet rolls, the multi-purpose towels, the table napkins, the box tissues now comes in beautiful new packaging as Flora Joy, Flora Smell, and Flora Giant. The flower disposable handkerchiefs are better than cloth handkerchiefs. You can call them on 0243033033. Now, ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Yeah. Well, I told you. Before I bring the first contestant on stage, let me pick a word or two quickly from the judges. And I'll start with you, Abeku Santana. Wonderful. Your expectations for tonight. Yeah, wonderful. Um, thank you so much for this amazing opportunity. I'm expecting that the contestants will have a deep knowledge about Ghana. As you know, this is the Independence Day edition. And we expect them to know how far we have come as a country. So that's all they should expect. <laughs> Right, Bridget O2. No, I, I would 
would want them to have fun with this day. I mean, it's, it's our Independence Day, so they should have fun on stage. Okay, Nanaba. They better get their information <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, so the contestants, 18 of them, will be appearing on the stage dressed from the region that they come from. They all will be representing a region. And so you're going to see a colorful display of our culture here this evening. Ladies and gentlemen, our first contestant from the Volta region, a round of applause for Epi. <laughs> Hi people, this is Epi and I'm standing for the next TV star. If you want to vote for me, dial star 711 star A3 hash. My unique code is 9. I want to thank Action Chapel International, all students of Sogasco and Kramer School. Good evening, Epi. Good evening, Epi. Au revoir. Um, your question. Before Osadifo Dr. Kwame Nkrumah proceeded to form his political party, the CPP, in 1947, there was the United Gokus Convention, the UGCC, which was founded in 1947. Do you know any of the founders of UJCC? Yes, I do. Mention them. We have J.B. Dankwa, Joseph Washi Dankwa. He happened to be the main founder. We have William Oforiata. We have Akua J. And then also we have Edward Akufu Ado. And then we have. Um, There's one more. Akufu Ado. The last one has escaped to me. The last one has escaped me. Thank you. That's okay. That's fine. Thank you. Well then. A round of applause for Epi. Epi is representing the Volta region. Ladies and gentlemen, if Epi is your favorite contestant, you know what to do. Now, moving on to the next contestant, representing the Western region. Ladies and gentlemen. I beg your pardon, representing the Central region. A round of applause for Ebenezer. I am fine. Okay, so um, okay, so um, Eben, I know you've had a horrible few weeks. You've had a horrible few weeks. I hope that today, you know, you get to redeem yourself. And yes. you're from the central region. And uh, my question to you is from your region as well. So, um, which city was our original? <laughs> I've actually given part of the question. I think, I think change it. <laughs> I'm going to change, change it. it. <laughs> okay. So, tell us what makes central region unique in our independence history. Okay. What makes central region unique in our independent history is that. When the Europeans first arrived in Gold Coast, they arrived on the shores of Central Region. And then they met Nana Kwamena Ansa, their chief of their town. And then what also makes Central Region unique, again, is the formation of the United Gold Coast Convention at Salt Pond. That's on, on the 12th of August, 9, 1947. Then talking about uniqueness in the independence of the country this year the independence that's working together bouncing back together was hosted in the central region of ghana that's the cape coast stadium okay um Eben, i i mean we, we've been tough on you in the past i i don't think i'm going to um heckle you so much um, I would have loved to also hear from you a bit about, you know, the tourism potential of, you know, what, what is. You mentioned that they arrived there, but there was something significant they did, the castle. It's very important. You cannot tell the history of that region without mentioning that huge edifice and its importance in our history. But like I said, I'm not going to be tough on you because you've had a horrible few weeks. So all the best. Thank you very much. No, um, please come Hello. back. Please Hello. come back. Hello. Eben. Um, Ebenezer. 
this is how far the Lord has brought you. <laughs> um, we all come from the central region. Yes. And central region is the citadel of education. Yeah. I mean, all the great educational institutions in Ghana come from the central region because the early Europeans settled in the central region. You cannot also talk about central region without mentioning our delicacy. We have the most unique food in the world. You understand? And <laughs> Examples like the Infante Fante and Eto. Yes, so no, 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 we are, we are judging. We're not so, so, so make Central Region proud because we have a lot to show. Without Central Region, Ghana wouldn't have seen white people or Europeans. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. Uh, uh, Ebenezer, I, I completely agree with Abeku and Bridget because I, I'm from the Central Region. Yeah. I'm a proud... <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a proud Cape Coaster. And I think you did not sell the central region. I mean, if I were from any other place and you said this about the central region, I will never go there because really, there's nothing there from what you said. So I think you should do better next time. Thank you very much. All right. A round of applause for Ebenezer representing the central region. Ladies and gentlemen, our next contestant representing the eastern region. A round of applause for Ahima. Hello, lovely people of Ghana. My name is Ohima, and it is my dream to become one of the best media personalities in Ghana. However, I can only achieve this dream through your support and prayers. I'm counting on you to kindly vote by dialing star 711 star 83 hash. I'm number four, and I need your support in order to be able to win this crown. I'm counting on all members of International Central Gospel Church, my family members, members of Central University, members of Gempa, members of University of Ghana, Legon. I mean the whole of Ghana. Please support me to win this crown and I will not disappoint you. I'll bring you one of the best performances on the show. The next TV star, it is your time. Yes, Nana. You're looking beautiful. Thank you very much. All right. I'm going to ask you a very simple question. Do you know Martin Luther King Jr.? Martin Luther King. Do you know Martin Luther King? No, really. Ah. Oh. Martin Luther King. Yeah. Do you know Ma Martin um, Luther King? Unfortunately, I haven't read about him. Oh, right. But you've never heard of him? Like his I name? I have. I have. But I do not have the fact at the moment. Oh, no, I'm not going to ask you to tell me about him. Okay. Have you heard of him? Yes, I have. Where is he from? Or where was he from? <laughs> Maybe I should put it that way. Okay, like Nana, I said, um, I do not have, I haven't read much about him, so I'll be grateful if you can kindly um, change the question for me. Okay. All right, no problem. I'll change the question for you. Don't worry. So, recite the National Pledge. <laughs> The National Pledge. Uh -huh. I promise on my honor to be faithful and loyal to Ghana, my motherland. I pledge myself to the service of Ghana. I pledge myself to the service of Ghana. Okay, please let me start again. The, the National Anthem. The Pledge. I promise on my honor to be faithful and loyal to Ghana, my motherland. I pledge myself to the service of Ghana with all my strength and with all my heart. I promise to hold in high esteem our heritage won for us through the blood and toil of our fathers. And I pledge myself in all things to uphold the good name of Ghana. So help me God. Okay, Ahima, Nana. well done. Thank you. Ahima, <laughs> um, 
yes, I beg you. Which primary school or basic school did you attend? I went, okay, first, I went to a primary school in my hometown in Achimosnase, which is the Presbyterian primary school. And then I later came to Nungwa and I attended Nungwa and um, JSS. Why month. were you hesitant initially in reciting the pledge? A big who. You know, be standing here isn't easy, so oh. I was a bit nervous. <laughs> well done, anyway. Well done. Well done. Uh, no, I, I, I am disappointed that you didn't know who Martin Luther King was. Um, yes, he's from the States, but he's a black person. He's a civil rights uh, movement leader. I mean, every single, every black person in the world must read about him. He was also in Ghana, in our independence, during our independence. Yes. And he has a famous quote that talks about, he hopes that someday every person will be judged by the content of their character and not the color of their skin. It's such a profound statement everybody knows. And for me, that, that was very disappointing. Thank you. You can go. Okay, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you, people. A round of applause for Ohima representing the Eastern region. Ladies and gentlemen, our next contestant representing the Ashanti region, Amasewa. <laughs> I am with this I'm a sewa. I'm with this year, you may be any more. I think it is a month from one pipe, and I'm one more, and I'm a voice. I'm time to cheer. My friend, I'm a free montum. Tell me, I'm a sewa. Dial star 711 star 83 hash. Now enter the next TV star. Me unique number A18. Me say that 1818. Tell me, I'm a sewa. Boame, me and two a day. I'm a fan, could you be able to know? Embrace me, I'm a sewa. Ama sewa sewa akutu ampafu braketu sewa ampafu braketu enton enton be na obo me bo asuna o ya asuna o ya asuna ni mo akra bo ya bo abey Aye, any no no question, any no no question. So the only one that Independence Day edition of the next TV star. Now, as in Bissau, me Bissau, Ghana edi Golden Jubilee. No any official edu num fifty years. Afi bay na Ghana edi Golden Jubilee anniversary. Me pacho si subio mami. Ene gane nya enfishia edio sienum. Enfie bi etwe mu gane nya enfishia edio num eye golden jubilee. Na ya febe. Oya calculation. Afi ben na Ghana di Ghana at 50. Be pa sure 2008. 1998. Two thousand and seven. Two thousand and seven. You're correct. That's correct. Two thousand and seven is correct. So, what, what makes you proud as a Ghanaian? What makes you proud? What makes you proud as a Ghanaian? Oh, wait, me answer the tree. So, if that's what you want to do, wait, me answer. Niema me ni jek se me ye Ghana ni. Aye, se ni aye si fa kumye 
and the jay a farm would ye, and the free a broth on your home. Nay, and Daffemba could say, Ye knew a monk or pa, and free a santi memu, ye didn't pop up, and tell me who I say. Nina, and no, yet to make jay a farm would ye eat, and no, and a mammy, and to make some yagan, and as I say, Yan Chiama a broth on a cry, and nobody see any, and I get a jay a farm would ye. Okay. Okay. Um, Asante Hima. Yeah, that was it. <laughs> A round of applause for Ama Sewa. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, our next contestant representing the Western region. A round of applause for Barry. Friends, fans, countrymen, lend me your ears. This is me, Beringa Irene Duku, coming your way at this crunch moment, soliciting for your vote. To keep me in this competition, you dial star 711 star 83 hash. You select the next TV star and you input my unique code, which is three, and the name Berry would pop up and you decide the number of votes you'd want to vote for me. I'd like to thank you for your prayer, your support, and your vote up to this point. I would also want to thank my headmaster and his assistant, including my friends, my family, and my church, the Holy Catholic and Apostolic Church. You've been amazing. Thank you so much. Hi, Barry. No, go on. No, go on. It's okay. Oh. Okay, Beryl. Um, when was Ghana? Berry. Berry. Ah, hey, Berry, not Beryl. Berry. Okay. <laughs> so, when did our name move from Gold Coast to Ghana, and what was the reason behind it? So, the name Ghana was something that um, the UGCC um, caucus had been um, deliberating about it. And then when we had our independence on the 6th of March, 1957, Kwame Nkrumah declared that Ghana would be the name that would be known by. Why? Like, what was the re reason? What's in the name? So what's in the name, really? Okay, so I know Ghana is um, from an old empire. And um, it's part of the empires that were part of the African um, sect. And so they decided to use that name. But what goes into the meaning of the name, I think I cannot talk for now. Uh, okay, Barry. I, I don't think you did badly with that. I mean, you were quite close. Uh, in the moment you talked about, you know, some tribe, whatever you mentioned. Yeah, you were, you were, you were quite close. Uh, I think you should read more. Because okay. on a day like this, you want to know why... Gold Coast didn't stay, but Ghana. You, you want us to understand why it is Ghana, okay? okay. But I think it wasn't bad. You look beautiful, by Thank the way. You. Thank you. Um, well, for me, very, I admire your confidence, even though you're not too sure, uh, but you were trying. You made the attempt, and I like the flow, your grammar, your... your, your, your She's an English teacher. Oh, okay. <laughs> But if you are asked the question, the name Ghana, Ghana means warrior. 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 And actually, Ghana comes from the ancient Ghana Empire, like you said, which was in southern Sudan. Um, there was empires in Africa. We had the Songa Empire, the Ghana Empire, the Sudan Empire, the Mali Empire. Um, because this history has not been taught in recent times, I can forgive you because... Um, in our social studies, and I mean, those who did social studies, you should have been taught. But Ghana means warrior. Okay. So anywhere you are asked, what is the meaning of Ghana? Ghana means warrior. And the reason why the name Ghana was given, J.B. Dankwa actually proposed the name Ghana. Yes. So you are right. In the caucus of United Goku's Convention, it had been tabled. But, you know, J.B. Dankwa's vision was independence in the shortest possible time. Then Nkrumah came for independence now. 
So knowing that ultimately Ghana will get independence one day, and Chroma adopted that name. So you are correct. Thank you. You've done well. A round of applause for Barry, representing the Western region. Ladies and gentlemen, our next contestant representing the Eastern region. A round of applause for Augustine. Hello, the lovely people of Ghana. My name is Augustine, a contestant in this year's Next TV Star competition. The competition has just got tougher. Therefore, I need your prayers, I need your support, and most importantly, I need your vote. To vote for Augustine, dial star 711 star 83 hash and enter the unique nominee code 12 to vote for Augustine. I therefore beckon on all Ganata old, stu old school students, knights and the knights and ladies of the altar, the knights and ladies of St. John International, and all Catholic faithfuls and everybody who loves the brand Augustine to vote for Augustine. Hashtag Team Augustine for the win. Anna. You look resplendent. Thank you very much. Yeah, I like what you. So, which region are you representing? I'm representing the Eastern region, precisely the people of Krobo Dumasi. Ah. All right. So, Augustine, I have a very simple question for you. Three ex-service men were killed in 1948 by the colonial police while marching to the Osu Christiansborg Castle uh, to present a petition to the then governor. Name these three ex-servicemen and uh, on which day it happened. Okay, so the ex-servicemen are Corporal Atipo, Sergeant Ajiti, and then Private Odati Lampu. Okay, so it was, in, it, it was in 1948, but on which particular day? On the 28th of February, 1948. Okay, <laughs> that, that's wonderful. Abeku, he's the youngest in the competition. He's 18. Wow. He just wow. completed SHS. Wow. Yes. Wow. That's, that's very impressive. Thank you very that's much. That's very impressive. Thank you very much. Kekejileke. Ingesaminya. Good, good, good. Um, I like, I like um, your confidence and you're very, you're very relaxed and um, you're taking it easy. So keep it up. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, um, and like, like Ebenezer, you've had like really tough, um, you know, periods. So I'm happy that today you still through, you are excellent, and I hope that people vote for you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. A round of applause for Augustine, representing the Eastern region. Ladies and gentlemen, our next contestants from the greater Accra region. A round of applause for Jepsam. I go Ghana man, nyame nkeche me, nyame me. This is season two of the Nest TV Star, and it's your boy Jepsam to keep me in the competition and to help me win this competition. Dial star seven one one star eight three ash. My unique code is eleven. Bantama Bimbila Kufrum. Nyankwala, everybody out there, New Spring manager, my family, my dad, my mom, each and everyone supporting the Jepsam brand. Quite a so estate, it's meeting Charlie, Miss Shemwa, Moon voting mommy. Let us bring this home, let us do this together. Remember, at star 711 star 83 ash, my Unicode S11. I am because we are Ubuntu, the next TV star, it's your time. Onukpa Jipsam. Charlie check who shot the J Shomo. Here for a. Here ado. Do you want to? Okay. All right. So this is your question. The colours of our national flag: the red, yellow, green, and the black star. What is the meaning of these colours? Thank you very much. The colors of our national flag, the red represents the blood that was lost or that was shed on the fight for independence. The yellow represents our gold and the natural resources we have in Ghana. 
the green represents the vegetation we have here in Ghana. And then the black star represents our skin as black people. Yes. That's correct. Well done. Which one is the natural resources? You said what? Natural resources, the red? The re Sorry, the yellow. The red, the gold. Gold, yes. yes. You said it represents what? The gold and the precious mineral resources we have in Ghana. Ah, okay, so you've corrected it. Gypsum, thank you. Thank, thank you for you. coming. Thank you. A round of applause for Gypsum. A round of applause for Gypsum. Ladies and gentlemen, to our next contestant, representing the Ashanti region, a round of applause for Harrison. Hello, lovely people. This is Paul Harrison Chimesi in the next TV star as Harrison. I'm so grateful for your support so far. If you want to vote for me and keep me in the competition, kindly dial star 711, star 83 hash. You choose option 1, which is the next TV star, and you enter my unique code, which is 8, star 711, star 83 hash. You choose option 1, and then my unique code, which is 8. I plead on all members of the Methodist Church Ghana, Northern Akadosis, and Domestic to be particular, all students and old students of UPSA and Action Center High School, and Ghana at large, vote for me and keep me in the competition. Next TV star, it's my time. <laughs> I, I think you should adopt the nickname Black Hole. It's fine. Um, I, I saw the question uh, and I changed my mind because I thought you had a, such a horrible week, so I don't want to put you there. So I'm going to make it very easy for you. Just sing our national anthem. <laughs> God bless our homeland, Ghana, and make our nation great and strong, bold to defend forever the cause of freedom and of right. Fill our hearts with true humility, make us cherish fearless honesty, and help us to raise this oppressive spirit of our will. And my forevermore, and help us to raise this oppression with all our will, and my forevermore. Thank you, Harrison. Now, Sanka, what to your national anthem? I was a Wija Wuntumanu. What's so me? Na na emoji. Emoji. Okay, but well done. Well done. Thank you. Well done. Um. You, you, you are a TV material, but looking at you, you have the, 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 the face, the appearance. You'll be a good TV presenter. Keep wearing the smile. When you smile, you look more handsome. So keep it Thank up. you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. A round of applause for Harrison. Harrison is representing the Ashanti region. Ladies and gentlemen, our next contestant representing the Eastern region, Joe. Ebenezer, baby, I'm going to pon. Edeme, I'm going to be drinking. Me, the Asde, I'm going to pon. Edeme, I'm going to be drinking. Me, the Asde, I'm going to pon. Edeme, I'm going to be drinking. As a day, you will be also a comma, a year, my sorry, my Saint Teresa Catholic Church. I will be a soft penny, a reverend father Moses Agojesu. I think some of you are media, said that a mamma, mamma, papa, and me, and me, and I'm watching the food. Baby, I can't say that you know, see, see, more I read. Now, me here, some of the two about a dear mamma, and I'm to me, a cosua, a casa, I can't see him. And it is up a set of one me, and mamma, to me, a cosu, a tra, I can't see more. Dial star seven one one star eight three hash. Now, for what you sue number six, and only unique number. Now to abandon Bia Pesa to Edimamina Edamas. Okay. Joe. As I say. And I'm about your meadow me way. Okay. So I only miss our bake with your friend and Mr. Tourism. But you are it's a funny saying you may yeah yeah global tourism seminar. Now you say wo co represent Ghana as a beku Santana. A dear in our befa over can fa. Ghana tourism, hmm. Achre, 
Gold, Okay, yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's it. Where are you? Where a friend is saying, a deep I will go to Metias, Star now with Frano. You want me to be see, me to be see. You two for me. I know you're being busy. And you are in Ferrawasi. It said you wouldn't name a mamrani, a money, and a tourism. No, I am to man who France who has an income. Why? Um, yeah, um, it, it was okay. I, 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 I would have loved for you to situate your um, things. For instance, when you said gold or cocoa, where is Ghana placed on that? Because we're not the only people with gold. We're not the only people with cocoa. But when you mention it and people say, oh, wow, are they the second largest? It, it brings their mind home because you're selling, you're competing with other countries as well. So situate it, give us more facts because just saying you have falls. I mean, Victoria Falls, why Butty Falls? So there should be a reason behind every single thing you say to convince an investor or a, tour, or, or, or a tourist to say, this is the country for me. That was not clear. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh. Mm -hmm. All right, ladies and gentlemen, our next contestant representing the Eastern region, a round of applause for Fee. Hello, everyone, viewers across the world. This is your brother Gideon Fifi at Darkwa. I'm called Fee in the contest. It's come a time where I need your support. I know you've been supporting all these well, but this is very crucial. The people of Tamale, my church, the Kanishi area of the Church of Pentecost, and all my friends and loved ones and family. This is the time I need your love. Vote for me. My unique number is seven. And vote to star 711 star 83 hash. Or visit the next TV star dot voting hub gh dot com and vote as many times as possible. Thank you very much. And God bless you for voting. Welcome, Fee. Thank you. Can I call you a war? Yeah, war. A war. A war, a war. <laughs> it appears you have fans. I mean, the audience are cheering you up. Why? Or well, maybe they like my swag. Okay. Okay. So, your question. In 1948, Dr. Kwame Nkrumah founded a school. Staff would dismiss teachers and students from St. Augustine's College and Fantipim School and um, Adisada. 
he funded the school with his own funds. Which school was it and why were the teachers and students dismissed? Thank you very much, um, Mr. Abe. But I have very little knowledge about that, so if you can change the question for me. Thank you. All right. All right. Um, that, that was Ghana National College, anyway. So uh, we'll our it. school. That's our school. So yes. We can't forgive you. We can't forgive you. Because, <laughs> because before Ghana became Ghana, there was a school called Ghana in 1948. That was the first school. That was the, that was the not the first school, but that is the first school that was named Ghana in 1948. And so we are very proud of our school. <laughs> okay. Right. So uh, let me ask you another question. Great. With regards to culture, because you are, you know, are wearing kente where the beads adorning them. It means that you appreciate our culture. Very. There is a certain kingdom in Ghana, which is listed among eleven kingdoms we have in Africa. Which kingdom is that? Is the Ashanti Kingdom? You are right. Thank you. Um, so, as much as I appreciate the second one, I, I am not a fan of uh, contestants coming on stage saying, I, I don't know about this question, so change it for me. Great. I mean, you were given ample time to read around it, and I, I, I thought it was actually a very obvious one. Yeah. So, no. Sorry about that. All right, Fee, thank you for coming. Thank you, Donna. <laughs> and of applause for Fee, representing the Eastern region. Ladies and gentlemen, let's take you back to the Western region. And a round of applause for Hackman. Hello, Ghana. I'm Desmond Pa Crazy Hackman from Sefioso. I'm a product of the University of Ghana, a dietitian, and a member of the Church of Pentecost. I'm Ghanaian to become the next TV star. Thank you so much for your support, your messages, your prayers. Help me. Become the next TV star by voting. Star 711, star 83, hash. Choose one, the next TV star, and then key in my unique code for team to help me attain this dream. The people of Kede who are supporting me, so if you also, I am so grateful. To my secondary school, you guys have been so, so helpful. Keep me in this competition. Let's bring this home. It's my time. Man, you're already a fan favorite, so please. Um, so we're 65. Um, please, can I correct something? Please, my region is Western North, and I'm proudly a citizen, so it's not hey. Western Region. Please. Okay, thank you. <laughs> you said Western Region. Ah, okay. <laughs> All right, thank you. Who was the special guest for today's ceremony? And what were highlights? Especially, she mentioned a particular sector that, that her... Well, okay, so I'll ask you the second question. But who was the special guest? Today's ceremony. Honorable Mia Amor Motley, the Prime Minister of Barbados. Okay, great. And what were some of the highlights of her speech? She mentioned a particular sector that Barbados had benefited immensely from Ghana and so good they are coming back for more. Which sector? Unfortunately, I... I have no idea on that. But, uh, okay. I'd be happy if I could get a different question. No, you won't. You, you won't get a different because question. You answered the first question. What, but can you share highlights of her speech? Or you didn't listen of at her all? speech? Yes. No. I have, honestly, I have no idea on her speech. Did so, you watch the Independence Day celebration today? I had opportunity to listen to the president. But no, I, did, I couldn't listen to... Um, Honorable Mia Motley's okay. speech. Thank you, that's all. Okay. Hackman, that's quite disappointing because we are discussing Independence Day and the climax of the celebration was what happened in Cape Coast today. You can't pick and choose what you want to listen to because, yes, the president spoke um, 
in fact, of course the president had to speak, but we, we, even if you check the president's social media pages, they kept highlighting the special guest of honor. So how can you not be interested in what she said at a ceremony to mark our 65th anniversary? That's quite disappointing for me. Yeah. Okay, um, like my colleague said, you have chosen an area of interest, but that is not good for someone who wants to come into the media. You must have a broad, you know, wide base knowledge about things happening around us. And if you were asked to read around the Independence Day, you rightly mentioned the special guest of Anna's name. So why couldn't you further, you know, follow her to know what she was saying? And um, uh, I think um, you should, you know, be interested in other areas. Don't choose areas. You know, today our media has become very competitive, very challenging. And if you want to come into the media space, you must read. You must broaden your knowledge. But that notwithstanding, or nonetheless, I like your diction. You know, your, your, I don't know. Yeah, you have a very good diction, you know, for voiceovers and even for TV presentations. So keep it up. Thank you very much. Thank you. A round of applause for Hackman, representing the Western North region. Ladies and gentlemen, all the way from the Northern region, a round of applause for Kudus. Hello, lovely people of Ghana. This is your boy, Abdul Kudus and I'm competing to be the next TV star. To vote for me, dial star 711 star 83 ash. My unique code is 16. The people of Sotum, Santa Maria, Accra, Newtown, Wesley Grammar School, Prince Bwati Memorial School. Let's do this. Big up. The next TV star is your time. No, be said I'm in OK. <laughs> Hello, Kudus. Kudus, Kudus the ladies' man. You're from the north? Yeah. Where? My father is from the north and my mother is from the Asante region. Okay. All right. So, Dr. Kwame Nkrumah did something really, really significant. Well, there were a lot of significant things. But there's one that completely stands out for our three northern regions. Now it's increased. What was it? The University of Development Studies. Hmm? <laughs> Dr. Kwame Nkrumah built the University of Development Studies. I, I, I think I need to call uh, President Rawlings. <laughs> yeah. Tell him that someone is changing history here. Okay, so th there was one thing that he did that every single time we talk about. I don't really you know. You don't know. You don't know. Yeah. Okay. You haven't heard about education, what he did for education. In okay. He made, he made education in the northern region free. So why did I have to lead you on? <laughs> okay. That's quite disappointing. Abeku. Um, my brother, Kudus. Yes, sir. Um, you know, today's episode is Ghana's independence. Yeah. And I was expecting you to have prepared for, you know, questions around our independence and our history. Though you are truly representing the culture and the people of the northern part of Ghana, this is not a cultural episode. This is independence episode. Yeah. And you were asked to read. So if you ask any significant achievement that Nkrumah made in the areas of infrastructure, Akosombo Dam, Temamoto Way. I mean, it's very disappointing that you can't tell us what Nkrumah did. And, and, and to tell us Nkrumah built University of Development Studies, <laughs> my brother. <laughs> my brother. I don't, think the peop I don't think the people of the North <laughs> will even forgive you. <laughs> Because he's rewriting history. Yes, you are rewriting history. <laughs> and like Nana rightly said, you know, this is an achievement of the late Jerry John Rollins. So um, if you want to come into the media, yes, if you want to come into the media, please 
read. Okay, read. Right. You are giving um, an area, a scope to read. So it shouldn't be difficult for you. Uh, I, I just want to say that ladies love beers, but they love intelligent men. True. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> A round of applause okay. for that was Kudus. So wrong. <laughs> A round of applause for Kudus representing <laughs> the northern region. Now back to the central region. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for Adipa. Hello, Ghana for me. I'm going to say, I want to pen so I'm going to my baby. Where I'm going to double money about Adipa in here. Cassia, I want him a drobian cadet, Munia Baba, Cope, Miami. Mesha was a mobile coswa, a voti, a diamond sunset. Jumediano, a idea, my idea, pa. Or be a bonny home wedding, and to see Sian vote now, and a home in Yaniti, Saupe Massam, and as I will pet, dear me, Yano, a measure will say, Uber vote Yama me, I was star seven one one star eight three ash. Now me nominee code, and so a number five, a noom, one two three four five, a noom, measure, so be vote Yama me, send a bear, Macosua, our can see any. Adipa, as your name uh, suggests, you're looking very beautiful. Uh, it's very simple and classy, very beautiful. But your question, um, Ufi Central Region, right? Okay. 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 Mama Fashe Ibasa Yedi was Central Region. Okay. Pacha Medase. Yo fit to a fashe and only a dinner will guide. And here, South Fashion, a young him for near a month for more honor with this South Fashion. Your son so ever back at three and only a dinner word, not Elmina. Easter Bia Swan, South Fashion, and a yedi. Your son so. Go, go on, go on, the third one. Okay. Hey. Okay. 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 Pa, <laughs> <laughs> You are so confident and you are making mistake. You said, you said, um, Edna would be back to Fine, that is correct. Then you went further to say it's in Easter every year. Easter, the big, the big, and the what is a Ghana Easter? The Kofo called Elmina Ekodi Bakatu. That is, that is where I have a problem. Okay. Ha! Uh -huh. It seems you have too much information. That's why they're calling you information. <laughs> okay, Adipa, Adipa. 
Me da so say at least what me call fetu a fashion because how you me chrome keep cost e dey fetu a fashion say nya me show why. Me ka che oduma kuma. Oda pejan osun. Me ka che. Thank you for coming. A round of applause for Adepa representing the Central Region. Ladies and gentlemen, let's move to the Ashanti region. A round of applause for Tracy. Hello, I'm Tracy Asamwa, a contestant of the Nest TV Star. To keep me in this competition, kindly dial star 711 star 83 hash and my unique code is 2. The Church of Pentecost, Nokia, North Kanishi District, Inspirational Art Ministries, Posa, Kumasi Wesley Girls, Old Students, and Nurses Training College, Pantai. Please keep me in this competition by dialing star 711 star 83 hash and the unique code is 2. Thank you. Tracy, I have a very simple question for you, probably the easiest question for tonight. Who built the Tema Motorway and in which year was it open to traffic? It was built by Osaja Ford, Dr. Kwame Nkoma. And in which year was it open to traffic? Please, I have no idea. <laughs> You don't know? Yes. In 1965. Okay. Thank you. No, she wasn't born. <laughs> yeah. Then can you sing Yanara Yasasini? Yanara Yasasini, a ya board in the Maya, Mojana Nanum Shegu near the Toho Maya. A drumini was so so, say a bay, a piatwa so, name the atwas on court or granny, we are first and mean cominia. Anyway, why I say, so we know what I say. Oh, my, he said, bay yo, oh, my, he said, rien yo, a yes, and I also, oh, my, for granny. Thank you, you can go. Thank you very much. A round of applause for Tracy. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's move on to the Eastern region again and a round of applause for Siang. <laughs> The Counselor's Diaries, TCD Official Page, Kaswa Mainina, Modeshia, Moba, Munia Berma, Kofisiao, and a Mijinal Konano, and the next TV star Jumedi, Mijinal Konano Mingyam Mumpaibo, Mochitai, and Afi Titsu will vote. It's as a man for Mochitai and Yina Michia, Metobaha, some person to Abana Mia, a star 711 star, A3 hash, now what ends up one, the next TV star. Nominee code no A13, one, three, Nominee code no A13. Let's try. Some better time to achieve a You not be able to train up. Siam, penigese. Bibi aboko diye. Yami adu me kwe kwe. Yeda onya onko pwase. Masi bisa me woma o ebefa amamre ho kakra. Be pa chow. Be pa chow. Adi inti na se ye na na nom omugu nsa. Omo de chire onya onko pwong. Na umu wia, umu sa yeshi ensano edi yagufo. Ansa na brofo da baba chira yense yewo nyanko pono. Na yedi musi yewo chedi yampo. Enti wamo de chira nese chedi yampo ye chira wansada yeba wansa. Sebe ya ensano okukukuni di ensadi yewo nom. Ansa na umu di ya masasi ya ene nana noma hinfo. Ya wadumu ekwa kuni fise wadumu di ye. Wadumu epe. Edi ye ya pedi yanso ema ye. Hmm. <laughs> wow. Okay. Uma me ni nua bema eba eya wodi e. Uma me ni nua bema eba eya mi nua. Then I go see go dey make say cousin. Um Yes, you are correct. Uma me ni nua bema as a ofa eba. 
and your cousin, and your union. You are correct. Oh, what are you doing? You are my cousin. You're amazing. I absolutely love you. Uh, you are consistent, and we love consistent people. All right, thank you. A round of applause for Siao. Representing the Eastern region, ladies and gentlemen, let's come back to the Greater Accra region. A round of applause for Leo. Hi, Ghana. This is Leo, a contestant of the next TV star. The competition is getting hotter and hotter, and I'll need your votes to stay in the competition. If you want to vote for me, dial star 711 star 83 hash. Star 711 star 83 hash. Dial 1, that's the oh next boy. TV star, and enter my unique code. My unique code is 1010. Remember, a vote for you is a vote for excitement and fun. The next TV star, it's my time. Um, two questions for you. The first one is, which hip life artist performed at the ceremony today in Cape Coast? Um, honestly, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't catch that. I didn't catch that. What? You didn't honestly, catch that. I, yes, I did. but did you watch the entire thing? No, please. I watched, I watched up to the end. Was there any? No. There <laughs> wasn't. <laughs> yeah. She tricked yeah. you. That's why I said I didn't catch that. Hey. Well, you're lying. <laughs> Masa. Ah, but Don't Blacko, Bla Blacko performed at Super Bowl, so why would <laughs> Don't do that. Okay, so my main question is, uh, Nkuma was arrested um, shortly, you know, before he became Prime Minister. Can you give us, you know, the year? Shortly before he became Prime Minister? Yes, please. He was arrested in... 1948. Okay. <laughs> the, the reason why I say he was arrested in 1948, um, he was part of the UGCC, um, the UGCC members that were arrested after and, the and 1948. And where was he kept? And where was he kept? In, in Sawan prison. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Abba, please. Abba, please, please take him. Sorry? <laughs> take him. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so you said 1948. It was 1950. And then he was kept at the James uh, Asha Fort. Asha Fort. Right? Yeah, the Asha Fort, Fort prison. prison. Okay, so 48 was quite close, but it's 1950, not in Sawun. Okay, I think uh, your Prisekans won't be happy with Definitely. you. Definitely. Because you know Prisek boys are... Oh, ah, I'm not being over being okay, so just try and catch okay. up, okay? All right, thank you for coming. Thank you. A round of applause for Leo. Back to the Eastern region, ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for Fernand. Hello, Ghana, this is Fernand. And I want to appreciate you. Thank you all for being there for me and supporting me so far. To vote for me, you can dial star 711 star 83 hash to vote. Remember, my unique code is 17, 1717. So to vote for me, it's star 711 star 83 hash. Then you select 17, that's my unique code, to vote for me. This goes to the Joy Hill School team, the Kofurida Sectikans, my fans, even those I don't know at all. Whoever supports the Fenard brand. Dial star 711 star 83 hash, select 17 for my unique code and vote for me. We move. All right. Fernand. Hi, Nana. How are you? You look really good. I love the hair. Thank you. I Thank love you. it. Totally love it. So, uh, do you know Martin Luther King? Yes. You know him? Yes. Okay. So he visited Ghana during our Independence Day celebration when we gained independence in 1957, 65 years ago. When he came to Ghana, he drew a parallel between the United States of America and colonialism in Africa. What was it? What exactly did he speak to? I have been told 
I know about him and his advocacy for Africans. Speak into the microphone. Anna's been told, I know about him and his advocacy for Africans, but I have no idea what he came to say when he came to Ghana. But are you aware he was here? Uh, no, no, I'm not. Okay, all, all right. That's quite disappointing uh, for me because, um, I mean, when you hear of Martin Luther King, you know what he stands for. He's a civil yes. rights leader. Yes. Um, so he came here, he talked about colonialism in Africa. I even gave you uh, something. I gave you information. And then he related it to racism in the United States of America. Yes. And the man talks about racism. Bridget alluded to the fact that the man stands for everything against racism. So uh, this, is, uh, this was such a, an easy question. I mean, we had cooked for you. All you had to do was to eat. But you couldn't even use a spoon <laughs> and your fingers. I, I, it's okay. <laughs> Don't explain. I'm big. Um, <laughs> Fernand, right? Yes. yes. Fernand, um, for a bonus max, I want to find out from you. Ghana has been credited as the first country to gain independence in sub-Saharan Africa. Yes. So it is the trailblazer of uh, freedom of people in the sub-region. There are certain countries in the sub-region that drew inspiration from Ghana. And some of the leaders of the freedom fighters of these countries have their first president who were very close to Osage for Dr. Kwame Nkrumah. Eventually, they formed the OAU, which later became AU, as we have today. Can you mention about three African leaders who were inspired by Osajifu Dr. Kwame Nkrumah after he gained independence for Ghana, the, then also forming the AU or the OAU? Any African leader who got inspired? Yes. Um, I, I, I don't really have a definite one for it. So okay. I wouldn't want to take Okay, let, let, me, let me rephrase the question. No, Abeg, I don't think you should waste your breath. <laughs> I, I think you should save it for your party tonight. Abeg <laughs> has a party tonight. A plus is party. Yeah. Bridget, were you invited? Yes, happy birthday, A plus. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, yeah, uh, sorry, uh, Bridget. Uh, so, um, I'm going to go to, back to the first question. So, when you asked anything about Martin Luther King, if you don't even know anything about him, think about, you know, black people, inequality, injustice. He is always talking about the color of the skin. So, yes. and if he's invited, there has to be a reason why, you know. I know, I know for his advocacy. No, please. Oh, please. Ah, Ghana, ni, what can I say? We are friends about my explanation. At the end, we are Yeah, yeah, church. Oh, so you you just think in that uh, uh, what is it called in, in that respect. Yes. And then you build from there because it's sad that somebody came here, got us wrong. We literally fed the person, and you could have picked something from it. I even use the famous thing he talks about, you know, and he, he talks about a black person who is not free anywhere. Then there is no freedom anywhere. So if if people are uh, uh, are being, uh, what's it called, uh, judged based on the color of their skin in the U.S. We can't have same here. So it, that's just who he was. So just read. That's all we're saying. Oh, all right. Thank you. Thank you. Ready? A round of applause for Fennett representing the Eastern region. Ladies and gentlemen, in the greater Accra region, a round of applause for Kiki. Hi Ghana, this is Kiki for the next TV star. I'd like to say thank you for your support so far to Christ Embassy Youth Church Airport City, to Crystal Galaxy Media College. Thank you. To vote for me, please dial star 711 star 83 hash. Select the next TV star. My special code is 1. Don't forget number 1. Star 711, star 83 hash, the next TV star, number one. Kiki. Ojeko. 
Okay. So, Kiki, I have a very simple question for you. Now, I've been going through the questions. I'm looking for the easiest for you. Before Accra became our, our capital city, there was a city in Ghana that was our capital. Which city was it? And can you tell us about this city? Cape Coast was the capital city of Accra. <laughs> hey, attention, hey, attention. Calm down, calm down. <laughs> Kiki, go on. Cape Coast was the capital city of Ghana. Good. Tell us about Cape Coast. Cape Coast is one of the coastal regions and in one of the 16 regions of Ghana, they celebrate festivals like Bakatue, among others. They are known to be very hospitable people, um, with cities, with towns like Elmina, Salt Pond, etc. <laughs> Elmina and Salt Pond are in Cape Coast? <laughs> ah! <laughs> okay, go on. Dazzle us. Fancy Fancy is known to be... Fancy Fancy is known to be one of their most favorite delicacies. Okay. Fancy Fancy. Okay. Um, Kiki, th thank you very much. But Cape Coast doesn't celebrate Bakatue. It's an Elmina thing. It's an Edna thing. Thank and you. Salt Pond. Salt Pond is not in Cape Coast. No. That's where Fancy Man is, right? And that's Abeku's town. He's from Salt Pond. It's thank not in you. Cape Coast. It's so far from Cape Coast. But sister. Ade. All right, thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. And a round of applause for Kiki. Well, it's been a long ride, has it been? Yep. Well, and I told you that this evening, two of the contestants will be leaving us. Did you vote for your favorite contestant? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. On this side, who is your favorite contestant? Yeah. On that side, who is your favorite contestant? Yeah. Who? Yeah. Is it that is it is it is it that fee is so easy to mention? So everyone says fee. Anyway, the next TV star is brought to you by Flora Tissues, MTN, Gino, Cowbell, Chop Shop, Infonifie. My dress is Kind Ketsi, Sema Brew. My hair, oh my hair, and my makeup cookie, the makeup girl. The show is broadcasting live from the Silicon House production and the experts in PA sound systems, LED, TV and radio production, broadcasting and events coordination, lights, and their specialty is customer satisfaction. You can visit them on www.siliconGH.com. Stay with us. We'll be back with eviction after the break. The next TV star will be right back. Child ever told you there was no tissue to use at there was no tissue to use at school? Have you had to reuse a dirty cloth handkerchief filled with dirt, sweat, or even mucus? This is so unhygienic. Flora Disposable Handkerchief is a more hygienic option. With 10 absorbent tissue handkerchiefs in a pack, you can throw one away after use and still have enough for the day. Flora Disposable Handkerchiefs, toilet rolls, multi-purpose towels, table napkins and box tissues now come in beautiful new packaging as Flora Joy, Flora Smell and Flora Giant and are available in a shop near you. Flora Disposable Handkerchiefs are better than cloth handkerchiefs. Isn't that right, darling? Yes, Mom. For both purchases, or Delta Paper Mill on 0323-033-033. Day by day, men, strong and refined. The skin care you deserve. Dream. Oh, in a minute, yo! <laughs> this is my nephew! Whoa! This place has changed, yo! Oh, yeah. I can't go, Yeah! 
Yo, Ajwa, look at you all grown up, yo. Some things never change, like Gino's quality recipe. That gives my food that rich color, unique natural taste every time. Smells good, yo. Hey, sister, we the wap pun sano and kasa, just like I remember. Ajua, chai, ne me shrink coin pa. Best jollof I've ever eaten. Wow, this is real jollof, mommy. Gino dear, am I trying to get the ankasa? Say Gino dear, fie ni fie. It's delicious, yo. This advert is FDA approved. I woke up this morning. Nothing wakes me up better than a cup of cowbell coffee. Delicious coffee aroma. Mmm. Uh, how can you forget your lines again? I'm sorry, sir. Just that it tastes really good. Cowbell coffee. Enjoy the delicious creamy coffee taste of three in one cowbell coffee. It's a beautiful day. Waiting. <laughs> This advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. When we connect, everything is possible. Whatever seems unreachable becomes even closer. Building partnerships. Redefining the norms. Because when we connect, being there becomes possible and new ideas come to life. Stay ahead and stay connected with MTN Business Broadband, superior internet solutions that drive your dreams. Sign up today on broadband.mtn.com.gh or call or WhatsApp 0244-308-111. Block no sooner fin our back. Men's room, any boys need to play up on this year. HD Plus gives you control over your TV viewing experience. You can now search, pause, reverse, and record your favorite shows just the way you want it. Charlie, like that movie go pew. Oh, yeah, we miss out. Oh, no, no, no. You know me, Sam, with HD Plus, you defeat record any show then watch them later. And with this HD Plus app, you defeat link come to your decoder then watch any movie, any show you want. Hey! HD Plus, they assemble more! <laughs> and now, when you download my HD Plus app on your phone or tablet, you get free data every month to watch TV... MTN, Gino, Cowbell, Chop Shop, the official photographer for the show is in Fonifier. My makeup is by Cookie the Makeup Girl, and my dress, Kind Ketsi Simmer Brew, and my um, hair, Kind Ketsi, oh my hair. Now you can watch this program. We are live on GH1 TV, we are live on Facebook, and you can equally watch it feely feely in UHD 4K quality via HD Plus, channel 100 on HD Plus integrated Samsung UHD or QLED TVs and also in HD Pictures on HD Plus Channel 106. The show, like I said, is brought to you also by Flora Tissues and we have Flora disposable handkerchiefs, toilet rolls, multi-purpose towels, table napkins, box tissues and they now come in beautiful new packaging known as Flora Joy, 
Flora Smile and Flora Giants. You can call them on 0243-033-033. Now, it's time to say goodbye to two of our contestants. We started with 18 of them tonight. Two will be leaving us. But before then, I give the judges the chance to name the best performer for the night. Abeku. Right. Best performer for tonight is Beryl. A round of applause for Beryl. So last week, Sian was the best performer. And tonight, it is Barry. Congratulations to Barry. Barry gets to walk away with a box or a bag full of floral, floral tissues. So, Barry, this is for you. Congratulations. You may go backstage. All right. Now, I have the names of five contestants who at least voted for. If you hear your name, you step forward. We have five of them. The judges get to save three because there are three of them. And then we say goodbye to the two. If your favorite contestant goes home, it is not my fault. And definitely not the fault of the judges because we asked you to vote. Are you ready? Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Yes. Contestants, are you ready? Okay. If you hear your name, you step forward. Adepa. Ohima, step forward. Kiki, step forward. Ebenezer, step forward. And Siao, step forward. <laughs> okay, so the rest of you can go backstage. Congratulations. All right, I think you should get closer to each other, Ebenezer. Now, we keep telling you to vote. Vote, because that's the only way your favorite contestant is going to stay in the competition. So, regardless of how good you think they are, if you don't vote, they will be evicted. So, these are the five least voted for contestants. Five least voted for. Let's just stress on that. Out of these five, three will be saved by the judges. And then we say goodbye to two of them. Who goes home and who stays? Bridget. I mean, Sion doesn't belong here. Please vote for him. Vote for him. Vote for him. Please vote for him. Vote. All right, Sion, you can go backstage. You'll be safe. I always like to leave the tougher one for Nanaba. So, Abeku, who are you saving? Hmm. Ah, this, this is a difficult one. <laughs> but two out of you will go home. <laughs> Can we have some silence, please? The audience, thank you very much. Kiki should stay. Congratulations, Kiki. You can go backstage. Okay. Sam, so I'm here. <laughs> Why always me? As Balotelli. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so, I think you've done well for coming this far in the competition. And whatever happens after tonight, Abeku had a piece of advice for you earlier. Abeku, what was it briefly before I... Yes, I was saying that um, if you don't make it as the next TV star, you have gone through this competition to build your confidence and also to expand your knowledge in um, a reservoir base. You have to go into public relations. You have to go into assisting I mean, influential people as their PA, 
Um, you can even assess pastors as their personal assistants. So there are a lot of opportunities out there. Once you have built your confidence and knowledge, you should be able to take the opportunity right from here. Okay? So not only TV, not only TV, but any public appearance, assistance job, you can do it. All right. So I have to save one person for the other two to go home. Information they will we are say. Now, name mum, name mum. I am saving Ohima. Congratulations, Ohima! You can go backstage. Unfortunately, Ebenezer and Adepa say goodbye to us this evening. We are sorry, but this is the end of the road for you. Come, come for flora tissue. <laughs> come for flora tissue. So, you see the voting reports on your screen? No libilibi, no labalaba. That's it right there. We keep telling you. And the vote. highest is Leo. Leo yes. is leading with both. Amasewa. At the past, Harrison. was the least voted for, actually. Yeah. And um, yes, please vote. Your favorite contestants may be really good but if you don't vote i'm sorry the yeah, judges may not be voting. able to save them next time congratulations you can go backstage so i stop faking <laughs> i'm so sorry i see that a lot of people are sad but i keep saying vote next week we evict two more so you know what to do keep voting for your favorite contestant. Thank you all so much. The next TV star is brought to you by Flora Tissues, MTN, Gino, Cowbell, the official photographer in Fonithier, Chop Shop, and my hair, oh my hair, my dress, Simmer Brew, and my makeup cookie, the makeup girl. Thank you all so much for watching the show. I'll see you next week, but we leave you with the Bobobo crew. Stop it.